All right, so welcome. Uh, I'm going to be playing Alien Isolation. Uh, I, uh, I bought this game probably five years ago when it was on sale. Barely played it. Um, very interested. I mean, I, I love scary games. I played the original Resident Evil way, way, way back in the day. Uh, me and my buddies would get together, turn out the lights, and scare ourselves to death. I'm just making sure that all the graphics are totally turned up. Um, but anyway, I bought it when I was on sale, which is what I do on Steam. I buy games, and then I end up playing them down the road when I'm bored enough. But, uh, so, if uh, you ever... Let me uh, just make sure... Let me get my channel pulled up in case somebody comes into chat. The... Uh, so we're going to see how this goes. I'm sitting in the light for your guys' sake. Normally, this is the kind of game I'd like to play in the dark, but uh, I do have headphones on, which I think kind of ups the ante. So we'll see how see how this goes. It's based on, obviously, the movie Alien 1979. If you've never... We're going to go ahead and... Mm, recommended way to experience the game. Challenging and terrifying. That's hard. They have four, three options before the way that they recommend. So we're definitely going to do at least hard. Ultimate taste test of survival is nightmare. Um, okay, we'll do nightmare. Ultimate, the greatest test of the morning for experienced survival experts only. I mean, I've played survivor steam achievements can be unlocked in hard or nightmare. I've played a lot of survival games. I'm definitely not an expert. So there might be a lot of saving. Yeah, do I really want to start a new game? Yeah, yeah. Just the slider is barely visible against the background. I don't see anything, so we're going to adjust it. All right. That's barely visible. But let's keep going, just to kind of contrast. Okay. Yeah, so we'll go to about there. That's barely visible. That What low seeks in? Okay. So anyway, um, if you like scary movies, I like scary movies. I like to get scared. I don't like horror movies. I don't like gore and all that crap. But uh, the Alien movie is amazing. I still, when I catch someone who hasn't seen it, I will sit down and watch it with them. Um, made in 1979 and absolutely genius. Because, I mean, just, you wouldn't even know. If you watched it today and you didn't know when it was made you would not necessarily know except I mean it, it feels old but the way that they did it you just there's just no way it's genius and it's terrifying try to watch that movie by yourself in the dark if you've never seen it try to watch that movie by yourself in the dark I dare you please and let me know how that goes for you um, all right the game is starting Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. Is that Sigourney Weaver or Sigourney Weaver sound like? Other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. That really sounds like Sigourney Weaver. Ash. And did Captain they, Dallas. Did they get her to, to talk in this? And ship destroyed. I should so, reach the frontier in about six weeks. This is exciting. Luck, the network will pick so this is basically picking up from the end of Alien One, before this Aliens, really which is an entertaining movie in its own right, but it's not of the quality of Alien. Samuels. I work for the company. For the company. It's about your mother. Oh dang, she doesn't like the company very much. 
she looks like this is like a uh, an homage to uh, God. What's that space game? With the dude. Where? It's in the suit. That's definitely not Scorny Weaver. So they might have gotten her to do the opening, but yeah, it's not even supposed to be. But they called her Ripley, so I'm confused. Proprietorial. I've heard proprietary, never proprietorial. What? I can't hear you. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Pretty sure this guy's a robot. Look, Ripley. Hey, lady. When this job Could you, uh. I read the case history. Just heat, maybe, uh, cappuccino? Por favor? Thank you. I mean, obviously, come on. God, he's uh, he's deep, isn't he? Why is this thing spinning? So we are playing this. Um, I probably ought to update the stream and mention that this is on like nightmare mode. But oh well. the biggest grin. Like <laughs> Use move keys to walk. It doesn't even tell you what they are, but let's see. Sign in. Okay. A. Ripley. Explore the Torrens. Alright, the mouse... Turning speed's a little slow. I'm going to see if I can make that a little faster. This mouse is, is unique. Sometimes it really is slow. So we'll increase the sensitivity. And hopefully that'll be sufficient. Let's see. Did that save? Yeah, let's see. All right, much better. Actually, we may have gone a little too far to the right there. Let's uh, let's let's bring this back just a tad. That's probably good. We'll get used to it either way. So, all right, that's good. What are they reading? Frank Herman War in Totality. Never heard of it. If that's like a, a throwback to something or something, let me know. Sure, I'll take scrap and a sensor. Take all, is that R? Press R. Can I open this one? Scrap, scrap, and an SCJ injector. What is that? It looks like all the other ones are open. So we'll keep moving. What have we got here? Were people sleeping in there? Hold on. I didn't do a very good job. Okay, so the place is empty. This is blinking. Why is this blinking? Oh, I can close those. Okay. Weird. It doesn't appear to be like a run key. I'm pressing shift, but I'm still just walking. Um, that's my nine month old. She's just trying to say hi. What do we got here? Compound B. Okay, sure. Take it. No idea what this stuff is. Here's a computer. Let's jump on that. Verlaine. 
You on the lookout for a navigational officer? I have a friend that's just lost a ship. He's looking for work. I can vouch for him. He's got good papers. Same old story. The Mega Corps undercut him. Picked up all his clients. Contracts are getting harder to come by for the smaller companies. I'm thinking of getting out myself while well, I still have something to sell. Sounds like you're doing okay, though. Dropped by the docks. Heard you just shipped out. Sevastopol Station. What a crud hole. Still, I hear Wayland, Utani, pay well. Good luck to you if you can't beat him, right? Let's catch up when you get back. Blaine. Alright, so who's for Lane? I get the feeling uh, this is important, but I can't make sense of it right now. Alright. Let's check what's in this cabinet. Nothing. So we woke up. Other people had apparently woke up before us. And uh, we're just trying to get our bearings. Looks like we're saving the game here. Yeah, there wasn't any current save data, so we're definitely going to overwrite it. Here's something to search. What do we got? Nothing. All right. Here's another one. Nothing. Okay. Ooh. What is this? Okay, some kind of fashion magazine, maybe? Nothing. Another computer to use. Let's jump on that. Nope. Apparently we broke it. We just turn it on and off. That's it. Get dressed. That's a good idea. Let's do that. Alright, objective completed. We got dressed. I didn't know that was an objective. Did it tell us where the objectives were? Alright, let's keep going. Nothing to see here. Can I punch? Nope. Left click, right click does nothing. Just a person walking around, getting into this weird box that I'm assuming is like an elevator. Push the button. Oh, it's a shower. I got dressed and then I took a shower. That makes sense. Not at all. Okay, cool. Now I'm soaking wet. And we're going to go back the way we came because we could have kept going straight. So that's what we're going to do now. Who is that? Is that a suit? Oh, yeah. Some suits on display. Okay. What do we think? Um, there's a Chinese proverb, when in doubt, always go left. When you follow that, it seems like it never works. So we're going to do the opposite. We're going to go to the right. Um, my wife and I literally did the whole, when in doubt, go left for years. And it always seemed to be the wrong way to go. Oh, there's a person. Hello. Taylor, good morning. Good morning. It's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You I people? I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Wayne and Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what You know, I wonder if that if I can say Sigourney Weaver stuff was just was just a copy from the movie. Like, I wonder if they were just playing her comments from the end of the first movie. Really? I bet that's what it was. It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? So I'm Ripley's daughter. Have you seen Samuels? It only took me 20 minutes Probably to figure that out. Down. I'll catch up with him. And I missed all of that, because I was still thinking. Speak to Taylor, okay. Oh, that was an objective, too. Where are my objectives? How do I how do I know what my objectives are? I can crouch. I'm trying. I tried J. Let me go back and try Oh, Okay, there we go. If I hit tab, get dressed, speak to Taylor, speak to Samuels. All right, let me find Samuels. Samuels was the guy talked me into coming on this trip. Explore the ship before you arrive. Okay, so let's find Samuels, the guy that is almost certainly a robot. And they always try to surprise you with that in the movies. Oh, boombox. Okay. Boom 
box that plays banjo music? What the heck? Oh look, it's a uh, Game Boy. Not really. Uh, okay. What's in here? And where's my inventory? I've taken a bunch of stuff. What am I going to do with a bunch of scraps, I wonder? I literally, guys, understand, I've never watched a YouTube of this game. Like, I literally have no idea what is coming and how it works. I am going into this totally blind on the absolute most hardest difficulty that you can play the game. So, there's going to be a lot of death. It's going to be really bad. Two and Taylor Nostromo incident. Uh, hey, Taylor, that's a, a euphemism for uh, that thing where a bunch of people got killed by an alien. Got your case request. Maybe take me a while to dig out the files. The incident happened before my time at the company. What is the, uh, the company? Some bit fuzzy on the details. Did they call it the company in the movie? I'm going to have to watch it again. In 2122, the Whalen yutani cargo vessel. They did call it just the company? That was it? What a stupid... Like, wow, that was lazy. Uh... Nostromo went missing. No trace was found of it. They were like, we're just not going to tell you anything. We're just going to call it the company and you'll know it's bad. Because companies, all of them are bad. No trace was found of its cargo or crew. Apart from a new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before, seven in all. There was Dallas. Yeah, these are all the folks. Like, I, like, I love the fact that it's really making me want to watch the movie. Um, is there more? What is this? Uh, oh, okay, up and down is, maybe, hold on, there might have been more to that other one. Let me go back, sorry guys. If you already know what's going on, I know you're like, what the heck is this guy doing? Oh, I don't know, how, oh, page up and page down. I have like a weird keyboard. Page up and page down, I have to hold the function key. Outbound and return transportation for Wayland yutani retrieval team to Sevastopol Station. Team consists of three... W2Y employees, okay, passengers, interstellar communications antenna, long haul hypersleep, okay, what, uh, from a tow rig retained, okay, cool, whatever. Go back to the other one. Q is back. Alright, let's see if we can page down here now. Okay, so we had a warrant officer, we had a navigation officer, a chief engineer, an engineer technician, Wayland yutani lost a lot of money. Uh, I called it lazy, but they worked so hard on other stuff. They could, they could afford to be lazy on the company stuff. Uh, it's a bit of a black mark in the history. You get the impression they don't like to mention it. Anyways, I'll try and find the files later, clarify some of the points. If you want, I can help you go through them. Maybe some of your luck will rub off on me. I hear upstairs have an eye on you for something big. Okay. Oops, didn't mean to do that. How do I go back? Q, Q. Alright. I know what I'm doing. Alien is not going to get me. Because I can crouch. Look at that. Look at those crouch skills. Whew. Scare myself. Uh, okay, this door's locked. Yep. Alright. So... We went right, and we found somebody who moved us along. We're not going to go what would have been left yet. We're going to go everything else except that. Could you imagine this game in VR? Like, look how crazy this is. I don't know why everyone says it's scary so far. So far, it's not scary at all. Samuels. There's Did Samuels. Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just impressed yeah, he doesn't need as much sleep as the rest of us. He's a robot. Told you. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M class. A later pattern for a slow construction. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Is Taylor all right? I don't actually wear glasses. These block uh, blue light. It's supposed to make it so your eyes don't have to strain as hard. She's a skilled executive. Should help us with any legal issues you might encounter. 
Why is he expecting us to encounter legal issues? Alright, we finished all the objectives, but we didn't explore everywhere, so before we go to the bridge for the briefing, we're going to finish exploring everything real quick. In case there's more scrap, which I have no idea I need. Man. What is this? What? What? Okay. Can I bring it back out? All right. Nice touch. Programmers. I'm probably walking towards the bridge on accident. Nope. Okay, good. So if we came in... Okay, there were suits on our left, but we could see them when we came in, so we must have come in from here. Yep. Came in from here, suits were on our left, there were suits across the way, we went to the right, we've been everywhere that way, we came back from this way, so left is all that's left. Uh, let's, and left is a dead end, so the bridge must have been something we've already been to. Uh, we'll go back after we check this. I wish I could speed my walking up a little bit. Is that a bridge? Are you a bridge? No. All right. We're gonna, well. I wonder if a door unlocked. Did that door unlock now that we've? Uh, I bet it did because I think this door was locked before. Man, that would have been so annoying if uh, if you didn't pay attention. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we are approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we doctor? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Sevastopol, that's how you say it. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? Lock and deloaded and calibrated. Approach vector lock. Oh, wow. I don't usually play with headphones. It's something we started doing with streaming, but it's crazy because I can tell if someone's talking from behind me or beside me or... What? It's crazy. Collect your briefing document. Alright. Um, collect my briefing document. It's probably somewhere out here in plain sight, but I'm going to make sure there's nothing else I'm missing around here. Uh, nope. Nada. How old is this game? I mean, if I bought it in 2015 on sale, it must have come out in 2013 or something, maybe. Basically, nobody. All right, nothing's happening except to uh, go look at this document, so let me go do that. Wonder what would have happened if I just didn't do anything. How long it would have taken for them to be like, hey. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? Looks like damage. Sevastopol. I gotta remember that. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. It's funny because they're using like video technology from St. Clair registration number MSV7760 calling Sebastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a Wayland Yutani bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. Yep, that right there tells you. My name happens to be Marshall. Okay, at first, when all it was was like that noise, that was enough for me to be like, nope, the we're not going there, folks. Screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You have heard from us by then. 
they've tripped. It'd be safer if Samuels wasn't here. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. That's a big caveat, because who knows what you're going to tell me to do, so... Could be extremely unsafe. Depressurizing. Fuck. Hating this. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. Yeah, Samuels is scared. There ain't no way. Are you kidding me? Are they going to, like, jump across? No. Fuck happened here? What are they on? Oh my God, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. <gasps> Oh, she's dead. What? Ha what is? I wish it. I wish it would have told us what we were going across on. I wish I knew a little bit more about what was happening. Who is that? Why? Oh crap! That's Ripley, and the first person she called for was Samuels. Come on. Yeah, I mean, just a little bit more detail, and I would have, I would have had a better idea what was going on there. She did not look very hard for her uh, friends. That was, uh, I mean, I get it. Yeah, she wanted to get to safety, but man, she shut that door behind her really quick. Alright, so, game that is not scary at all, it has picked up the, uh, picked up the pace a little bit here, alright. Don't forget about these mad crouching skills, oh crap, she won't crouch, it's cause of this outfit I'm wearing? find help <laughs> okay I might be able to do that I'm changing now all right so I have changed and I can crouch thank God all right it's dark when in doubt don't go left. Use registration points to manually save your progress. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, they will warn you if enemies are nearby. Okay. Nobody said anything about enemies. Let's collect some scrap. We're going to go ahead and save the game. There is a beeping noise. Is that a warning? Because it's not very helpful. Except to get your blood pressure up. <laughs> oh, that's fun. That was awesome. You would definitely need headphones to really enjoy that. Okay. Something about stepping over this. What does a Marshall checkpoint look like? Because if I knew, I would proceed there. Um, go the way that's left. Let's go this way. In the movie. When you hear the beeping noise, the faster it goes, the closer you are to something that is moving. Um. Cool.
Cool, cool. Cheap attempt at scaring me. Didn't even register at all. Except I'm lying because that kind of freaked me out. Uh, can I jump? No, so that means this is not even an option. Let's go this way. If I was, like, in real life, I wouldn't be crouching. I'd be going, hello, hello. Can anybody help me? Because I'm supposed to find help right now anyways. So I'm not going to crouch. I'm just going to walk around here and be like, hello. Anybody out there? Can anybody help me? Because... I just lost two of my friends, or at least two people that I worked with. Um, what do we got here? What is this? Nada. Here's another. We literally just saved the game over here, didn't we? No, I'm imagining things. Okay. Oh, I can run now. This game doesn't tell you anything. Oh. How did I totally... Nope, that's a dead end. Alright, well, there must be... I must just have to walk across this. No, it won't let me. It sure enough will not let me, so I'm missing something. Can't go this way, can't go that way. Help! Can't go this way... Boy, did you try to play Alien Isolation on Nightmare Mode? Yeah, I couldn't get past the uh, opening scene where you walk in a circle. Uh, come on. Nope, nothing, nothing. Alright, I've literally been everywhere twice. What am I missing? What am I missing? If I go out this way... There's nothing here, except one, it's, there's, I must be screwing something up over here. Can I, what are you? Oh yeah, there we go. I can climb through the walls, of course I can. Why didn't I think of that before? Um, maybe like when you're on nightmare mode, there's no tutorial. I'm, I'm thinking maybe the other, the other ones, it gives you a little bit more of a tutorial. And in my case, uh, I'm just not getting anything. Okay, we got past the big fire. Is there anything over here? Nothing? Alright, help! Help! I just crawled through the walls. I need assistance. Here's a computer. Let me access it. What does it say? Sevastalink. That was what it was. Sevasta, Sevasta pole, something. Back up a little bit here. Nope. Go back. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, share decommissioning. Okay. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Sevastopol by now, and I can confirm it's official. We are being de decommissioned. I will go over with each of you what this means in regards to your contracts and next placement, but for now, we will have a job to do. The suits want this done with a skeleton crew, which means we'll only be getting a few outside of contractors to help, but it does mean overtime. We like that. I recommend taking what you can while it's available. Point out that decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for. <laughs> I'll personally escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to Marshall Waits. Oh, that's not how you spell my name. So, totally different. There's Marshall and Marshall. They're, they're, they're totally different. Totally different. Um, we came from the big blazing inferno. Um, hmm. Employee lounge or employees only? Let's go to the lounge. That's to the left, I know. It's also a dead end, of course. See? What did I tell you about going left? Uh, walk and walk and. What the f. Okay. Yep. 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 Alright. 
very reminiscent of the Tomb Raider, the opening of Tomb Raider, where you like fall into a cave and are sliding through stuff, which is an awesome game. If you have not played Tomb Raider, holy crap, you need to you need to fix that. Not the original Tomb Raiders, they were awful, but the uh, the one I got it for like seven bucks, and I felt bad because uh, it was so freaking good. I would have happily paid fifty bucks for it. All right. Press Q to open. Oh, thank you. Got the cappuccino, folks. It is go time. Hold Q to open the radio. Wait, no, stop. I missed it. Okay. Hold Q, press R to activate the flare. Activating this flare. Here we go. Right mouse button, aim, R to place. Whoa, hold on. Aim, hold R to place. Oh, I didn't I didn't mean to do that, but okay. Can I pick it back up? No. Alright. No problem. So I'm guessing I can crouch and crawl through here. Yeah. So good at this. Uh we have some graffiti. So apparently the professionalism of this ship went downhill. Someone you always know working Joe. Oh wait, they were tearing this place down. Was it this place? Was that what that email was talking about? I'm trying to kind of catch up. I'm, I'm not real good at piecing these things together from emails, I guess. Alright, do we want to go up the ladder yet? I don't think so. Moving. No, let's go back. I hear noises. Someone's knocking or pounding on a door. Let's go back here real quick. Um, there's another spot I can crouch through. This isn't the way I came from, is it? Am I just... Oh my... What? Hoo-wee! Gotta get used to the headphones. Got to get used to the headphones. What's in this? See, I'm glad I didn't go up the flamethrower fuel. That is promising. We like flamethrower fuel. We like flamethrowers too. See, I would have missed out on 25 flamethrower fuel. Um, all right, well, it's kind of sad when uh, a little bit of noise makes you almost wet yourself, but hey. Up we go. What is that noise? Somebody's playing some music. Oh, it's a boombox. Not a song I recognize. Hello? Oh, she even said it. Literally just said hello. Anyone here? Okay. Can't restore power. She said it's super quiet, though. Um... Really wishing I had that flare right now. The one that I accidentally set down. Um, what is this? Something's making a lot of noise. Use these terminals to update your map with unexplored areas. Okay, let's update the map, folks. Uh, okay. What do I push to look at my map? Map data, I just updated the map. Didn't I? No, archive logs. Okay. Personnel log, wow, that's a lot of personnel that we have a lot of questions about. Search the space flight terminal for help. 
Um, switch floor, switch floor, switch floor. Nope, nothing, 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 nothing. Did we not just download map data? Did I break the computer when I touched it? Is that what happened? It is so dark. Doesn't anything here work? That's what she just asked. Find a way to restore power to the shutter. Okay. Do you restore power? I have no idea what I'm doing, but sure, do it. E, 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 E. Go for it. Oh, we gotta do it multiple times. Come on. Go, 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 go. We have power. Maybe. Do we? We might have power. Is there anything fun to look at out there? Nope. Let's get some. What's going on in the terminal? Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jeez. Do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry. No one goes down in the terminal anymore. Not after what happened. Also, we're out of meds. That's out of nowhere. Low on water, so you're going to need to get some. So you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe I'll teach you to take care of our stuff in the future. Anna. Jeez. Goodbye from, let's see, goodbye from Siegson. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegson Corps would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived at Sevastopol. Wait, Sevastopol? I can't remember how to say it now. Over the years, in hopes that Siegson has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment, our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be assured that that... Central AI and Working Joe androids will be here to serve Sevastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the very best. After all, we're not just a station. We are people. Audio. Let's go check out the audio. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock no, hold on. I want to hear this. How do I? Harris, Turner, there you go. Wow, that is the most deadpan reading. Might as well have got me to read it. Uh, we're going to need our paper. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, utility, restore power to departures, nothing. All right. Something just moved. So we're going to save here. I need to go to the little boy's room. So we're going to pause after this save and we will get back to this. Catch you here in a moment. <laughs>